So this dress is more of like a basic plain black dress. Um, it was originally 138 and now it's 117, which is a great um, discounted price. So I'm gonna try that for you guys, try that on for you guys right now. Just to get the full effect of it. Okay, so here's the dress. Very simple, very elegant, I think. Um, I love how it kind of flares out on the bottom. I'm not sure if you can see that. It has a little bit of a flare with the material, which I love. I think it's just such a flattering shape. Of course, black is like the most flattering color ever. Um, I'm not sure if you guys see one. I've always wanted to try that brand. How's the quality? I love it, like absolutely love it. I've actually bought another dress from them maybe about two or three years ago. It was kind of just like this silhouette, but like more purple, yellow tie dye. Um, the quality is so good. It is really comfortable. I'm speaking from the other one. It was very comfortable. This one I haven't really worn yet just because it is like a little bit fancier in my opinion. Um, but very comfortable. What I have on is like very comfortable right now. I love, love, love the little pattern on it. I don't know if you can see. It just gives like the perfect detail to it. Um, yeah, love that you have the texture to it. Yeah, agreed. Um, interest in the black look agreed because obviously black can be not boring but just very classic and like straightforward and I like that it has like a little bit of detailing I also like that it has like a little bit of a cow neck I feel like sometimes like too much of a cow neck can be really messy um I also love like a square neckline for some reason I just think it's like very flattering um so yeah I love this dress it's so flattering you can pair it with like any color heel obviously since it's black a pop of color would be so cute I think in my opinion um of course like I said this dress was for like wedding guest looks so you don't have to wear it with heels honestly I feel like with a white sneaker this could kind of be really cute but this with like the pink heels and the bag for a wedding I think would be so cute and just like very classic look with a little bit of pop of color at the shoe I think it's so perfect very comfortable and of course in the back it has a little bit of detailing here and of course like I said I know it's a bit of an investment but a black dress is never going to go out of style it's kind of like a little black dress but it's like not little which is I, I love that it's very classic you can wear it when you're older when you're younger it's not too um, revealing or anything like that so I feel like it's something that you can have for a really long time if you have been like I know Bella said interested in trying this brand this might be a really good place to start it's a great classic black dress and they have great other dresses too so it's a good introduction to this really great brand um, thank you guys for the comments yeah can dress it up or dress it down for sure I honestly didn't think about wearing this with white sneakers but now I might have to do that I don't know it feels like the material makes it tough, but it could be kind of cute with, with white sneakers. I don't know, pair up, more casual daytime look. And then also on the other side of that, I love a chunky heel. I know that it's really in style to wear like a very like thin heel, thin strappy heel these days, but I love the look of like a chunky black shoe. So these with this look could be cute and all black look. Again, super classic, literally can't go wrong. I feel like this would make a lot of people comfortable and feel really good about themselves in all black. Like I said, such a flattering color and such a flattering dress for sure. Um, so yeah, this is like a great look in my opinion. And yeah, you can definitely wear it with like casual shoe like this or even like the yellow heel and other pop of color, of course. Um, and even like this bag. I'm all about pops of color. If you've, if you've watched all of my shows, all four of my shows at this point, I mean, this might be a little bit much together, but the bag and maybe like the black heels would be so cute. Um, dressing up, obviously, a black dress like Bella said originally. So yeah, these are some of my favorite looks so far. Um, thanks, guys. Thank you for the comments. I appreciate it. Does anyone have any questions? Thank you all for joining. I am going to talk about one more dress. Unfortunately, I can't link it. Let me grab it for you guys. So, 
This dress is by Misa LA. It's a great dress. I can't link it, unfortunately, but I can definitely post it on my Veritop profile. So if you're looking to um, get it or look into the brand, you can definitely check it out there. Um, it's just such a flattering shape. I'm going to try it on for you as I did for the others. So here is the other dress. This was a part of my wedding guest looks um, for week three. Um, I love this dress. I mean, it, again, such a flattering shape. It's super fitting here, but like not too fitting at the bottom. So you're not like having trouble walking. And I think that's perfect. Um, the top is a really nice V-neck, not too revealing. It's like the perfect amount. I think it's perfect for if you're like a wedding guest, obviously a little bit fancier, but weddings can obviously be fancy. So this could be the perfect look. Um, thank you. This dress is by Misa LA. I'm sorry. I can't link it for you guys. Unfortunately, I can't add product links after that, the fact that I make the live stream, but I'll definitely post it, um, on my Vajra profile in tomorrow. So with this dress, I feel like it would be good to wear just like a tan heel since it has a little bit of sparkle. I'll come close to, to show you guys the texture. Um, it does have a little bit of sparkle on it. I don't know if you can see that. It's so flattering. It's knitted, which makes it so comfortable. I was a little nervous that because it was like sparkly and knitted that it was going to be kind of itchy. It's not at all. It's so, so soft and so comfortable. So I just paired it with these very um, minimal, but a little bit of braid, like a tan heel, short little heel. It's perfect for this like um, wedding look and obviously like a neutral bag, a wet, like a white bag or maybe even like this beige bag. I feel like this would be perfect for a fancier event. And you can even dress this dress down too with like, again, I know I keep bringing these up, but they're so versatile because they're just so like neutral and just a great summer shoe. So I feel like you can even wear them with these and maybe even like a chunkier nude heel would be good too. Um, I don't know, I feel like maybe I could even wear them with, again, with the white sneakers. That could be kind of cool. I don't know. So the sparkle makes it a little bit fancy. So I feel like I would have to play with that one a little bit, but for sure the nude heel is the way to go, I think, um, for any fancy event, or like I said, a wedding, of course. So this is a great dress, love this brand. Um, thank you guys so much. Can you see the back? Yes, the back is just plain, nothing crazy. Um, the black dress has a really good back. I know I showed you guys that, it's like a little bit strappy, it's perfect. Um, adds such a good detail, but this one is plain, which I do like, cause it, you know, what's great about that is like, you can wear a regular bra. Um, I feel like that's such a plus these days. Cause it's so hard to like find with like any, um, summer dress. So I feel like having that, um, covered back could be really good, um, for bra purposes. So I have about five minutes left. If anyone has any questions, everyone's wearing sneakers with dresses. They are, you're right. I feel like the material is like tough though. The material really like depends on like what shoe I'm gonna wear. It like makes or break it for me. Um, but yeah, everyone is definitely dressing dresses down for sure these days. Uh, thank you guys for the comments. I appreciate it. Thanks to everyone tuning in. So just a reminder, if you're tuning in right now, um, the four squares right here. That is where you'll see the collection of all of the dresses that I'm showing, unfortunately, except for this one. But the rest of the outfits and the inklet, the jeans, the shoes, um, I'll be showing in the collection right here. So if you're interested in any of that up to 30 minutes after the live stream, you will get 15% off of those products. So if you're interested in any of them, definitely check them out. I recommend all of them so much. Um, I picked them out of my three weeks for a reason. So I really have been loving them. Like I said, this anklet, haven't stopped wearing it. It's my favorite. Um, let me just answer. Okay. Would a denim jacket look okay for a cool night? Maybe I feel like for this material, like I said, since it is like sparkly and knitted it, with sneakers, it might like help the dress down look actually like adding denim to a look. So that would be perfect. Maybe I feel like I'd have to try it on. Maybe I, let me get a denim jacket. I'll show you. Um,
I don't know how this would look, honestly. Let's see. Oh, honestly, not bad. And you know what I think is even really cute? Um, just draping a denim jacket over your shoulders at night. I feel like that's such a classy way to add denim to an outfit. Yeah, this is like, this is like perfect. And you can like add sneakers with this and it definitely goes it down for sure. It's a great suggestion. Um, I definitely might wear this at some point in the summer. So cute. Even with a blazer too, like a neutral colored blazer, that could be really good with this dress too. Love a drape. Would you wear a blazer or a leather jacket? Yes. Read my mind. Um, I would definitely wear like a blazer or even um, a leather jacket. It could be so good actually for this. I feel like in the winter, that would be perfect. Definitely a way to like winterize it a little bit. Um, you could probably wear it in the fall. Yeah, exactly. In the fall or the winter, that would be like an ideal outfit for sure. And like adding leather to anything totally makes it very wintry and adding denim to anything makes it a little bit summery. So I feel like those are two ways to like definitely spruce up this dress or even the black dress for sure. That would be perfect. Great suggestions. I love this. I love interacting with you guys. It's so fun. Um, is it more gray or blue? Hard to tell over camera. Definitely more gray. I, I feel like it does look a little blue on camera, does it? It's definitely more gray, I would say. It kind of looks like silver because it has that, that sheen to it. Um, and I don't see much blue. Maybe in certain lighting it does, but for sure in person it looks more gray than blue. Um, looks up. Thanks for sharing. Of great chance with us. Of course, I'm so happy to do this. It's so fun. Um, I have about two minutes left if anyone wants to ask any more questions. I hope everyone had a really good long weekend. I know I did. Sneak peek of next week. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Um, I don't have the product with me, unfortunately, right now, um, but I am doing shoes. The, the overall theme is pastels, which I have been absolutely loving lately. If you go to my Instagram, you know that I love a light pastel color. So I'm so super excited about that. Um, I am going to be choosing from a few different tops and some shoes, which I'm like so excited about. And even I think a handbag too. It's a lot. So the this theme is a color. So it's going to be pastels in many different um, categories, which I'm so excited about. Definitely fits my theme for sure right now. Um, so yeah, definitely tune in next week, 730, same time, same place. I can't wait to hang out again and style some of those new items with you guys. I'm so happy I got to do a great overview of what I've loved so far for anyone that's missed them in the past, the shows in the past. Um, it's a great opportunity. So yeah, I just want to thank Vera Shop again for letting me do this every week. I've been having so much fun and thank you guys for interacting and being such a good audience. And I really appreciate the love and support. And I hope you all have a really good night. If there's no other questions, I will see you guys next week and take care.